LDP still have a, a very large margin of the majority, and LDP is in a coalition with Komeito. So even though there is a unified uh, candidates uh, against uh, against LDP by the oppositions, that doesn't necessarily mean that the uh, opposition is in a strong power. Uh, so let's talk about specific issues. Do you think the Japanese public are satisfied uh, with uh, recent governance uh, under the LDP? Well, it's not exactly uh, satisfied. Uh, there are uh, so many things, uh, scandals by the Abe administration and Suga, and as well as um, uh, there are some mishaps of the um, responses of the COVID-19. So there are a certain level of uh, dissatisfaction of the LDP government, but I think there is um, not much uh, interest in uh, having the opposition to, to govern. So I think um, people tend to vote for the status quo. So what about uh, Prime Minister Fumio Kishida's uh, domestic policy? Um, are you, uh, for, uh, are you uh, expecting some uh, major changes to that of uh, Shinzo Abe and uh, Yoshihide Suga? Um, Fumio Kishida is a more liberal side of the LDP. Um, um, the Abe and Suga was on the, uh, on the right wing side. So I, there is an expectation that uh, Kishida will take more liberal stance against uh, um, a departure from uh, Suga and Abe. But um, it seems that um, Kishida needs to have a balance in, in the party. So he is standing one hand uh, on the, on one foot on the um, on the liberal and one foot on the, on the right uh, right wing so i think um, uh, there is a slight change of the distribution of wealth etc but uh, in terms of the foreign policy defense policy and uh, many other things uh, kishida will uh, stay on the rather conservative course